Intel's ARC graphics cards may have been a big hit, but Intel plans to launch multiple ARC variants in 2023. Intel graphics guru Roger Coderie in an interview with tech site Gadget360. Coderie also said Intel's goal with the ARC is to attract mainstream PC gamers with 200 watts to 225 watts single socket GPUs, rather than competing with 600 watts monsters. Intel's continued commitment to ARC was the most important aspect that came out in the interview. There are rumors of a partial or complete cancellation of the ARC graphics chip. So when asked if Intel would stick with its ARC roadmap, which includes next general battle margin celestial GPUs, it was good to see Coderie's unequivocal answer. Yes, absolutely, Coderie said. Coderie didn't share details, but said Intel plans to release multiple ARC GPU variants in 2023, once the hard work of building the original Alchemist hardware architecture into graphics cards like the Intel ARC A770 and A750 is done. We want to iterate quickly so we can compete in every segment, Coderie said. Coderie also said that ARC's goal is to produce efficient, usable graphics cards. Performance per watt, or more performance with less power, is my priority. There's always going to be someone with the skills to say, I'll give you more juice, but I'm focused on less power. Another problem I've found with just adding power and praising benchmarks is that while it's great from a marketing standpoint, there's a limited number of PC users who can buy a card like this and plug it in. That cuts your total market down a lot, doesn't it? In the case of Codery, this means offering GPUs that can run from a single power plug. My priority right now is to reach a mainstream audience with a power plug. It gives you 200 to 225 watts. If you hit it and things are a little over and a little under, they all fall into the sweet spot, he said. Codery also highlighted that Intel is working to address driver issues that affect the Arc's performance in older DX9 and DX11 games that rely on high-level draws. The two most challenging API draws are DirectX 9 and DirectX 11. Driver updates for DX9 should follow relatively soon, and DX11 is not far behind. They are inevitable, there will be some nice announcements. It will make a big difference, we are not talking about 5 or 10%. In some cases it is much higher, Codery said. It turns out that the latest driver version improve. If you like this video please give it a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.